let's continue our journey through the realm of superconductivity. Superconductivity is a state of zero resistance. This state can be achieved in substances like mercury, tin, etc. by cooling them beyond a temperature called the critical temperature. Bit another interesting property that is the expulsion of magnetic fields from the surface. This is known as the Meissner's effect. But the Meissner's effect is indefinite. That is, superconductors cannot retain their superconductivity after a certain magnetic field strength, which is called the critical magnetic field strength. When the superconductors are subjected to a magnetic field beyond the critical magnetic field strength, they cease to possess their superconductivity. The theory covers the behavior of type 1 superconductors. which are superconductors who cannot retain their superconductivity in the face of even small magnetic fields that is their critical magnetic field strengths are very low translating them into items of little practical use the bcs theory explains the behavior of these type of superconductors in the 1950s through the efforts of john bardeen leon cooper and robert schieffer This theory explains the behavior of type 1 superconductor. Due to the Pauli's exclusion principle, electrons cannot occupy the same energy state. Similar to two people, one of them who is an opportunist and another who actually does not like opportunities. The first person is energetic in the face of opportunities, while less so in the absence of them. The second person has opposite reactions to the same state. That is, they can never occupy the same energy state. but when these two gentlemen meet they have influence on each other making their reactions to similar situation the same that is they occupy the same energy state whatsoever the condition this is a characteristic property of substances called bosons which include photons which are carriers of light in other words the two people behave as a couple pair which is a pair of electrons which occupy the same energy state this pairing enables them to pass through all kinds of situations in the same energy state that is avoid any kind of distress in the face of any kind of situation but this attraction cannot be maintained at higher temperatures that is they require low kinetic energy of particles to stay together when the couple pair passes through the internal structure or lattice of the superconductor it passes through unhindered via a curious mechanism according to this theory one of the electrons emit an inaudible sound wave called a phonon and the other electron obviously absorbs it this exchange of energy somehow keeps the couple pair electrons together this can be understood through thinking that the other electron gets a positive charge a hypothetically positively charged electron repels the lattice of the superconductor while the relatively negative electronic charge attracts it this balances their forces and makes their net result zero making them lose absolutely zero energy this is all about the bcs theory in a jagannath